up internet i thought today would be a good day to show because we're going to drone demonstration all day at a location undisclosed just kidding it's in dayton see ya so just kind of want to go over some of the the points from today um couple things to note one it really pains me that we use chinese drones in the united states um i really think it's a modern day trojan horse uh, for details i can dive into later um but the biggest biggest ones being data security number two is the operation with um so the groups that are doing operations were fire ems swat uh, those are the main groups there are three different operations and the operations are just still very clunky. Um, not many people know how to really interface um, with using a drone. It's not as simple as just um, throwing it up because it's another tool in the toolbox for the operations that law enforcement and those um, characters do. So it's still a very clunky operation. Um, point three just makes you want to work harder, faster to get stuff done more. Um, we're working on some wildfire stuff right now. Um, the inspection stuff is, you know, it's still going on, but um, wildfires kind of been peaked interest with some federal agencies, uh, especially after last year's wildfires in Sonoma. Uh, got a hold of some people, and there's interest in some work that uh, the co one of the co-founders uh, did as a graduate thesis. It's on the website if you want to read it. And then uh, the last option is, uh, yeah, I mean, we're met some of our university partners out there. Um, if things shake out the way they're shaking out with funding and engineering, um, we might actually have an autonomous drone by the end of the year, uh, which is pretty exciting. Uh, but I mean, it's just you know constantly you know working at it, working at it, working at it. It's um, ten o'clock at night. You know, I've been going since four, so uh, it's coming together. But uh, it's frustrating. So just get this done. <laughs>